Hello everyone. Today I will be going to teach you about how to make bus stop or Gynoscope oh packet tracer. For that, you need the connection between the hub and the PCs. Now click on this. First of all, click on this network devices. Select hub and press Control and PT hub. A plus bold symbol will be here so that you can automatically select hub and display onto the screen. Now press on the mouse. See the hubs are automatically being displayed now look I have took here five hubs now the amount of PCs that I am going to take is not five but three because the starting because we are making the bus topology the starting and the ending hub will act like a terminator okay now Go to this PCs. Still similar step for this as well. Control and select this PC. Now only you have to click. Now you have to give individual IP addresses to the PCs. Go to desktop, IP configuration and give the IP, suppose I'm giving a class C address, you can give a class A, B, any address because 192.168.10.1 it is a class C address, so submit mask will be 3 times 255.0 copy the IP address and you only need to change the last bit which is the host bit copy this and do the same similar step to the two other PCs go to desktop, IP configuration 10.2 close this go to the last PC desktop IP configuration 10.3 after giving IP addresses to all the PCs now a point to be noted is to be that always connect the networking devices with a copper crossover wire I will be repeating once more the networking devices will be connected by a copper crossover wire look how this hub is a networking device connected to other networking device devices will be connected by a copper crossover wire now second point to be noted is that a connection between the node uh, computer with the hub or a networking networking device should be copper straight through this is the second point a connection between a node and a networking device should be made with copper straight through wire After doing this, you have given the IP address to the PC and made the connection as well. Now go to the simulation, Sele uh, delete all this filter as show all none and select the filter from edit filters ICMP, ICMP which means internet control message protocol which basically does the functioning of where to send the message from sender's IP address to receive IP address close this now send the PDU this is the PDU symbol suppose I want to send the message from this PC 0 to PC 2 now play this run you will see the message is being transferred look the hub has a hub is a broadcasting device so it will transfer to all the other PC the symbol this the sim this symbol represents the hub does not have any path to send the message Took the cross symbol because it is not our destination address similar here it will turn back to the same sender address this is how bus topology works in Cisco packet tracer a tick will come here and you can also see the status is successful here so this is how bus topology works and it is a good topology but oh, have 
a disadvantage as well. Suppose I want to send the message from this PC0 to PC2. The, the message can be private as well. So it will send to the PC1 as well, which is not a good thing. So is bus topology. Bus topology, which is also known as line topology, it is the computer's setup where each node is connected with a single backbone cable, which is the coaxial cable or any other cable. So this is the basic definition of bus topology. Now we will be discussing some advantages and disadvantages of a bus topology. Now, first of all, what are the advantages of bus topology? First is it is quick to set up. Second, less cabling is required. So it is less expensive and uh, now coming to the disadvantages of bus topology if the main cable the coaxial cable the single backbone cable is damaged the whole network will fail and it will shut down second point network network performance in bus topology is slower third point every workstation can assess all the data on the network as I've explained you, I want to send the message from this PC0 to PC2. It will send the message to this PC1 as well. So this is a great disadvantage of a bus topology. I hope you liked my video. If you like it, then please share and subscribe.